Yeah, I kind of look scuffed right now, but um, that's life. I, yeah, we looked for some different houses, um, and turns out there's not that many good houses. So I'm back in the old room, boys. There's a cat. Make sure you can't see him. It's a cat. That's a McDonald's bag. The classic. All right, um, like shot. Golden Bolt, yeah. You guys, uh, you guys ever seen a Golden Bolt before? That's rookie of the year. No big deal, but it's a big deal. Um, no. All right, so um, we sort of talk about the roster. Um, I'm not really going to talk about my roster apocalypse shit. Um, what will I talk about? Um, I don't know if Penny's said anything. No. I'm not sure. Um, but basically Leviathan's decided to, uh, go forward without me and Penny. Um, me and Penny were down to play with him. Um, but they decided to take that thing and find a kill for us, which is fine. Um, I think that they're going to be a good team for sure. Um, I do think um, it's a bit of an interesting change, um, considering that that team went, I think what, I think we went 11-0, and 0. we broke like the all-time win streak with that team. Um, and then the next two sets we could have won as well, but we already locked first seed, so... You know what's going to happen after that with Steven. Um, yeah, I mean, that's life. Um, I do think that the change is interesting for them to do. Um, but now, I'm also very happy to be back with the Bolts. Um, for some reason, a lot of people thought that I hated the Bolts, or that I thought that they were a really bad team. Maybe that's on my end for um, the way I handled leaving bolts or something. I'm not too sure. I feel like I feel like when I left the bolts, I left in pretty like high regard to the bolts. Um, I said that you know they're all like some of my closest friends, um, and that I thought they were, they were a good team. They just failed at tournaments. Um, so it's kind of strange. After I left the bolts, they kind of had like their first split where they performed poorly, like ever. Um, it's season eight. Season eight, um, what we were like, I, I don't know. We were, we were like top three the entire season, I'm pretty sure, on bolts. Season eight. Um, and then, let's see. I actually had this pulled up because I, I have this prepared. Let me make sure. I'm not leaking anything. It's kind of nothing to leak now, I think. All right, so this is this is bolts. Phase one of when I left them in season nine, they were second seed, tied for first. Again, second seed behind Kings, and then phase three is their first phase where they perform really poorly, which is when I left. Um, so it's it's just odd to me that off that like one phase, people kind of just like thought that they were like shit or something when they were like a top three top two team like for two years straight almost except for a singular phase so i don't think bolts are were a bad team i think that we just had four performances at tournaments and there's really like not many things you can figure out like it's really hard to figure out why you're losing tournaments it's not like regular season at all like tournaments are just a different beast um so, I just figured, you know, Leviathans being uh, the Season 8 world champions that, um, and, you know, they had tournament success with Steven. I figured 
I would have a better chance of winning tournaments with them. That was literally it. That was it. Because it was like the end of the end of the road last phase, I was hoping to win worlds or have my give myself the best chance to win worlds. That's really the only reason why I left Bolts. They're a good team. They were a great team. They were literally top three, top two, like for two years straight until I left. Um so yeah, I mean it's just I want to clear that up. I don't know why people like think I hate the Bolts or I think that they're bad or that people think they're a bad team because they weren't. They aren't, and they still aren't. <clears throat> um, but now that that's over, this Leviathan's Bolts talked about, I think. I think that just leaves a new roster, right? Um, so, now we're Ravens. You show. This is Scott, bro. It's the Ravens. So we have Hurry, Sprack, Van Barami. Hold on, let me just see. Oh my god. No way it's an off wash play, bro. Okay. Okay. Oh, you get you get the gist. No way the line's gonna be cocked off, bro. Please let Jake back in the league. Okay. How? Okay. So. Maybe we're going to have to talk about it. All right. I'll be the guy. I'll be the guy because I know I'm not going to hurt Jake's feelings. We're boys. Listen, to preface this, to preface this, Jake is literally like, I have, I have a lot of good friends. Um, but there's two people that I consider, like, the closest to me. And that's Glavis and Jake. I'm sure you guys know them. Um, they're, like, my closest. They're my best friends. Like, I mean, I have a lot of good friends, too. There's, there's Solo. Um, but those two are, like, the ones that I hang out with the most. To preface that, now, the reason why Jake isn't on this team is because he's hard to work with. Sometimes he's a little bit stubborn, and he's a little bit hard to, you know, convince of things. Um, that's the main thing. That's it. That's it. Jake is just hard to work with sometimes. Um, so... So... Now we have Hurry. And, um... We're expecting Hurry to be... Good. We're expecting him to be um, easy to work with. He's gonna have a lot of uh, he's gonna have a lot of ramp up, and he's gonna be easy to work with and improve with. And I expect good things from Harry. Domo. I'm a believer. Um, other than that, then it's like Sprack. Um, and I mean, I'm excited to play with Sprack. I think he's gonna be uh, really fun to play around and play with. Domo. Yeah, Jake. I'm not. I'm not gonna get like. Ser the thing is, okay. Uh, now that I now that I kind of like said something bad about Jake, I'll say something good about Jake. Bro! I think Jake is literally a top support when he's on. Like I think Jake has the potential to be the best support consistently. Um, he he's shown multiple times throughout the past. You think Smokey for shit thirteen months? Jake has shown that he's like he can be the best support in the league a lot of times. The problem is just like the consistency. And a few other things. Um, it's just that he's a bit quirky. And there's a lot of quirky, quirky players in the league. That's how it is. Um, yeah, I mean, Jake has the potential to be the best support in the league, and he's shown multiple times he can be. Um, yeah, other than that, wish Jake the best of luck. He's my boy forever. Um, I expect him to still pop off and make good plays. He's just a little bit quirky. A little bit quirky. 
Um, and this is not meant to be a bad thing towards Jake. Like, people are gonna be like, oh my god, Haddock said Jake is- uh, Jake is not bad. Jake is a top support. He just has quirks that are tiring to work around sometimes. So let it be clear, Jake is not bad. Jake is a top level support. He's just a bit inconsistent, a little bit quirky. Okay. Um, what else? Um, so the big thing that I'm expecting on this team is that I think our trio, our mid trio is going to be really good, to be honest. Um, I think every backliner in the league loves to be led and to be told what to do. Um, they just want to focus and hit their buttons. And with Hurry and Scream, I think that's going to allow Barra and Ven to do that. They're both going to say nothing and just have Hurry and uh, Scream talk for him. I mean, not that they can't talk, right? Like, every backliner can talk and plan things. Um, you know, they'd be submissive. Like, every backliner just should be, like, focused on hitting their buttons and, and playing well. Um, it's the frontliner's job is to be setting up plays for them, in my opinion. Um, yeah, I think that this team will be really good for that, where they can just focus on hitting their buttons, and we'll have a lot of communication between me, Hurry, and Scream in the front line. It'll be good, I think. I think it'll be interesting, too. I think it'll be pretty fast-paced playstyle, but we'll see. I think that's about it, right? I think that's kind of everything I can talk about. Do you have any other questions, or what? I'm not doing that, Serge. I'm not doing the call. No way it's bird up, Strack. No way we're doing bird up. Call, call, bird up. This team, bro. Alright, no, no other questions? Also, by the way, by the way, no, nah, that's it. What's the blue pile behind you? It's my bed. All right, we're done, right? Last leaving? I mean, I'm not, I'm not last, and um, I wasn't on the team while he left. Um, I don't know. I mean, people just want to try new things. Have to hit up last for his, uh, his opinion on that. Yeah, I actually, I didn't realize it, but um, Ben and Hurry, the Hurry drama, now they're on the same team. I actually forgot about that. They're going to call each other Tower Boys. Are Ven and Hurry going to be able to work with each other after having such a big drama last year? I don't know. Jeez. Alright. That's it. We're playing Spine. And now, Rom will upload that, and then I won't have to answer any questions ever again.